Oh no. Part 3 of this. And it opens with this annoying character. Why? It has to recap, but only on the third episode. Makes me think they thought this was a two part originally. This is like hell for me. I hate this character's voice. How does he even know all this? Great joke, dumbass. Make him stop. Okay, so this is the last part of this, and then I'm just gonna stop because, oh my god, I'll <laughs> stop for a bit anyway. There are so many episodes in season two. Season one had like ten episodes, season two has a bunch. I mean, maybe a part of season three, though. That, ch that chain is tiny. It went from like four chains in C episode two to like one chain surrounding. Now it's two. Chain continuity errors. Let's keep watching the chain. It's gone up now. The chain's moved up. So I'll shoot you in the dick and hope that... Literally no one else is trying to prevent their fate at all. Holy shit. But yeah, like, Throttle has a girlfriend and she's a mouse too. Vinny may have a girlfriend and it's Charlie. Moto's just like, fuck this shit. <laughs> like, I'm a robot guy. Further proof that biker mice are as strong as One Punch Man. <laughs> they bust through an asteroid. <laughs> oh my god, it's like the end of JoJo Part 2. They're gonna fall under the <laughs> volcano. <laughs> oh my god. Ultimate Cars. He's coming. <laughs> what is with this angle? Why is she staring at his dick? <laughs> that eye line. And now there's rain. They're literally gone. What the fuck? I love that they're splattered in what is looks like fucking molten lava and it just chill. Diluted molten lava is still fucking dangerous. Why would they just let their skin be covered in it? I'll be back. <laughs> she just clipped out existence too. He just takes the mask off so people remember he's Plutarchy in it underneath. Otherwise he'd always wear it. <laughs> yeah, you know that time when you just leave your girl on after a date and you're like, hey, and you turn back to her on your bike and like, I'll be back and then just like give her a big thumbs up like, yeah. <laughs> it was like the dorkiest shit you can do. What's even happening? All of these effects on top of each other look like crap. Holy shit. 
And when they do this shit with the silhouetting and like the bloom and shit, you can tell it's because they know that they did a bad job drawing, so they're just covering it up, you know? With heavy effects. Seriously, put your visor on, he stinks, we all know this. Kidding me? Lindbergh is still in the picture after all this shit. Oh! Somehow they believe propaganda made by another Plutarchian about their fucking own race. People standing around Napoleon Brie changes in every shot. shows they, they have like uh, the illusion of progress and then it's just like it goes back to square one at the end of every episode or series of episodes and you're like I was actually looking forward to the idea that there's something would progress <laughs> oh savagery He had a matchstick in his mouth, but seriously, only about three frames of animation, and he's never shown with it again. What the hell? Was was Grease Pit's front wheel missing in that shot? I'm gonna wind back later when I edit this. So I'm gonna check it out. The wheels aren't even animated as moving. They're just like the, the scene is moving, and you just not supposed to notice that the wheels aren't even animated as being moving. They're just stationary. And here they are, but like before when it was diagonal, it was just like smoke covering most of them. <laughs> Again, they always have those, so nothing is like a risk. For these guys, it is. sudden cut but it's not the most sudden in the series. They caught him again. I got a plan. Did it send him back? Oh. Wimberger has really <laughs> wept you in my clutches. Hmm. I always wanted a mad scientist on my bail. Why are the fish Especially got his face? Your generosity is gratefully accepted, your gallant greatness. Consider 
he had a gun pointed at him. They said top rates. He said top rates. They shot a quarter. Then they put the same gun next to him, and he went, "Oh, I see." It's like he had a fucking gun the whole time. What the hell is wrong with this character? Oh, they're putting him up against the wall. They're going to shoot him. Firing squad. Let's do it. Meat shield. Do it. Do it, you pussies. What happened to Moto's eye patch? Looked like a monobrow for a second there. be helping him out anyway though. Like to be honest, Carbine has a point. They've had so many chances to murder and dethrone this guy and they've blown up his building hundreds of times for two seasons and then they're like, no, we've been trying to kill him. It's like, let him off the hook like five or six times minimum. kind of person who takes over a thing and then immediately rebrands it all with just pictures of his fucking face. It women is. Yeah, get rid of the one that's gonna get you sued by Schwarzenegger the fastest. Ding. Punched a fucking car over. That's rad as fuck. If I go through my entire life not having one hand punched a car over, I'm just gonna think, why am I bothering being alive, you know? Aww. Poor Grease Pit. <laughs> Didn't find a trolley anywhere. Wet haired lady. She's called brown hair. <laughs> Tasteless is his own face. Is she redhead or I see that as brown? Uh oh, it's easy top stolen her. I'm glad this only attracts specifically ice asteroids all of the time. No matter where it is, no matter what part of the building it's in. No matter what planet it's on. I 
I can hear Schwarzenegger rolling in his non-grave. <laughs> Didn't this, isn't that literally what they did in the first type so that they met them as well? They kind of just stand there posing like hero prisoner. We're gonna get you motherfuckers and then do nothing to like this three of them and none, none of them take that moment to detain anybody. And as for my dear wife Wimberger. Yes, yes, I know. One moment. You are my superior in vision and intellect. I admit defeat. Permit me to shake your A slimy asshole. They did write certain things that he does very well. Slimy and unbalanced. My good man, is there any way to address a superior? What? Yes, I'm afraid so. My dear old fish school friend has decided to overlook our little rivalry. He and I are oh, he's such a fucking liar. In fact, slimy liars. <laughs> Dead. I'm not being funny, but threatening someone with guns that only stun you and knock you over, it just feels very like, or why do you need trigger discipline at all? Especially when they all just then shoot at each other anyway. <clears throat> yeah, we'll take hostages. Be careful, I might knock her out. Uh, okay, I guess that's bad for her in the long term. <laughs> like... I mean, count the seconds that Bree's been out, and he's basically got some permanent brain damage on the Glasgow scale. <coughs> what I do when I meet a girl I've had a crush on and I miss for a while is give her a big ol' high five. <laughs> <laughs> You literally did nothing. You actually mounted your motorcycles and let him get away. It just meet every time. Like, Carbine has a point. They literally have them all tied up and on the ropes, and then they go, oh, well, we'll come back tomorrow when he's, you know, it's not fair now. <laughs> it would appear my assets are now frozen. <laughs> 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 Alright, what a day! Save it to a planet and put in a big cheese on ice. Yeah, for a while anyway. Pick him out of the rubble and send him to Mars! <laughs> God damn it! Work here could literally be finished in like five minutes for fuck's sake. I'm so mad. He's like, oh, I can't see my chick. It's like, I don't think Frodo wants to go back to his girlfriend. You and freedom fighters everywhere will never be forgotten. She changed her tune. Oh. <laughs> Well, that was nice. 
these episodes are getting more and more like they're trying lots of different things all the time. Um, but yeah, it feels like they're going in like five directions at once, but it's all like pulled out their ass at the same time. I mean, it feels like I wrote it. <laughs> oh, man.